He's got a 29.69 PB around here. He's probably been a bit off his game of late. But this is a, a drop back in grade for him. Green light is turned on. Set to run. Race five. Third heat of the Brian Johnston. Ready. Racing, Kurong Nugget jumped okay. He's pressing hard, pushing up fly for fashion. Held Kurong Nugget. Australasian Art ducks to the rail and now ran into the favourite there, Kurong Nugget, who's back to fourth. Uh, moving through Oakvale style. Gee, she's got into a great spot. And Kurong Nugget's dropping out here. Passed there by Star Jigs and also Emily Nearer. So Oakvale style's the one you want to be on. At this stage, fly for fashion led. Oakvale style hugs the rail. Fly for fashion's a length in front. Oakvale style struggling to pick it up and can't. So fly for fashion held Oakvale Style, who had every conceivable hope. Australasian Art and Emily Nearer, the next pair in. Gee, star jigs and something surely amiss with Kurong Nugget. He dropped out to run last, 30.04 the time. Number two, fly for fashion, kept finding and has held Oakvale Style, who had every chance to run her down. Two from four, Jane McNichol with... Uh, a running double, basically, with Fly for Tricks winning the previous and Fly for Fashion now winning race number five, defeating Oakvale Style and Australasian Art. And uh, three-fourth, Kurong Nugget. So it's finished better than midfield Kurong Nugget in the field of six. Um, but, yeah, surely something amiss. He, he didn't go anywhere like he normally would. Two, four, one, three. 30.04 the time. 4.46 early, 13.11 on the way home. A length and a quarter of the winning margin by three. So all credit to Fly for Fashion. She had to pull out plenty, and she did. 2.413 on race number five.